Alright guys, so uh, I may have screwed up a little bit and accidentally simmed, but not a huge deal. Nico, he sure goes first overall. Perfect, because I want Timothy Liljegren anyways. Um, I'm just saying that it was pretty funny because the Maple Leafs won the President's Trophy last year and now they got the third pick. Uh, Dallas has two top six picks, so looks like they're trying to rebuild a little bit. And then we get the 27th. Okay, so that's perfect. Let's go see who we scouted. Oh, let's check out the projected top five first. We scouted OHL guys all year long, so it's you know, Lilgren. We scouted this guy all year long. Nolan Patrick scouted him. How is he an unknown? Oh, he's in the WHL. Huh. No, we got way too many centers. We're going to again, boys. You already know. A high elite. Some pick. Let's see what Patrick is. High start. Ah. Should we have picked him? Oh, low top nine forward. Oh, my God. Thank Jesus. Holy. Oh, that could have been. I would have been so upset with myself if I decided to pick him. Any late round uh, steals? Top four, that's not bad. Oh, okay, there's a steal right there. Top four. Okay, so they go for two forwards. <laughs> Poor Tampa Bay. Nolan Patrick at a low top nine. <laughs> Should've went Liljigan. High elite, baby, high elite. So, wouldn't mind picking up another Tendi. Well, we'll see what's available. Kaminsky, Nesterov, Parazogan. Or we could go with the Enforcer, Crosby, eh? <laughs> what country even is this? Like, who's. Pakistan, Russia. You know, we're just gonna go with this guy. We got tons of uh, young guys. Why not? Let's we'll see what he is. He's a medium starter. That's pretty good. Miss out on any guys? No, I think we got a pretty good pick actually. And yeah, we'll pick our second rounder. we get that other tendy while we're at it? That'd be pretty sweet. Or we'll, uh, if we can't get that tendy, we'll go Gavin Crosby. Oh, they're both gone. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Parazogan. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll take you. Top six. Sweet. We got any other second rounders? I don't think so. Alright. So, I'm gonna send the draft. Sweet. We got, uh, I'd say it was a pretty good draft, actually, boys. Liljegren, a uh, medium starter goalie, and a top six forward. It's pretty successful to me. Let's see uh, who else we gotta re sign here. I don't think we have too many people. We'll see what uh, Liljegren is at currently. I think he's around a. Uh, 65 or a, like a really low 70. Bo Bennett, yeah, you're coming back, buddy. You had a great season. Three years. Okay, so the. Hmm, what about two years? Yeah, I'll bring you back for two years. So that's when our other guys. Mason Raymond, you are coming back, sir. You are a solid fourth liner for us. Philip Grubauer at 81 now. Yep, we'll bring you back. Go like that for a two-way. Love it. Culkin, top 60, eh? 23, love it. You're coming back as well. 79, that's perfect. Bergman, Dredger. Sure, let's sign you. Worst case, you play in the AHL for a couple of for your three years remaining. Connor Ingram. Yeah, I think you're going to be our A 
beach all starter, buddy. It's time. Time to start working you in. Maloche. Top four. Yep. You're getting signed too. Jake Bean. Do I leave you for one more a year? I think I got to, man. Zip. I think you're gonna come up and play some AHL minutes. Um, no, nah, you're gonna stay one more year. Clayton Keller, you're staying one more year. U11, you're staying another year. Garland. No idea who you are. So I'll give you that shitty contract. Lalonde. Nah, you're, you're done, Joe, buddy. Sorry. Alex Nylander will give you another year. Chikrin, giving you another year. Sign you back. Three years. Sadawi. Yeah, sure, we'll give you another shitty contract for three years. No, no. Kaminsky. Yeah, he's only 19. That's 68. That's pretty good. Julian Gauthier, you're only 19, so you'd have another year 21. Okay, so we're gonna have to sign Buddy here. So he was he was kind of a rough pick, but I'm not too worried. Paris Ogan, you're getting one more a year. Timothy Lodgren, 18, 64 overall. You are going to be a stud. All these guys, you can all have one more year. So we'll see what's up here. Accept it, accept it. Yep, yep. This is our playoff here, boys. I see just in case I didn't miss none. So we'll go ahead and try and sign a stud here in free agency. How much cap space we got? $30 million in cap space. Holy. Getting released, Sly Winder. Sorry, buddy. Shouldn't have tried to take my days minutes last year. <laughs> 19. Yeah, we're just gonna give all these young guys one more year to progress. So we will, yep. That's it. Wow, we did not sign many people. But we we're just sitting right outside uh outside of a playoff spot last year by the looks of it, 34, 36, and 2. Let's go see what we're dealing with here. Jamie Ben. Oh, man. Let's make sure. Um, UFAs. We don't want no RFAs up here. So, Jamie Ben. Looks like Rafi Torres, yeah, buddy. Bad, eh? Just passing at him and oh man, Jamie Ben and friggin' oh, Ben Bishop, Michael Neuwirth, perfect. That's the contract I want right there. We're gonna give you a five million dollar contract for one year in Oilers. 85. That's what we need here. So my dilemma is Do I I think I think we gotta sign Jamie Ben. Like Justin Williams. Yeah, we're gonna sign you too. Like that, we'll give you four mil. We got tons of cap space. But the thing is, when all those contracts come out for my young guns, you gotta sign them to fat deals. You can't have this contract. So I'm gonna have to trade him in a couple of years, but he's gonna sign for now. I'm gonna sign you for 10.5, 10.75, Jamie Ben. You and oh my God, you and Stammers playing a line together. Oh man, what a filthy line. Ryan Reeves, where's Raffy Torres? You already know we're signing Raffy Torres out here. 
this is cool. That's what I'm talking about, baby. 2.5, Raffy? You want that, buddy? Yeah, you do. Let's go out here and get a defenseman while we're at it. On top five here. What's Grossman? All these guys want two years. I only really want to sign it for one year. Grossman, you want one year, buddy? 3.5, eh? How about 3.75 for... 3.85? 3.875? Yeah, yeah. Let's, we'll, we'll sign you that, buddy. And let's go ahead and check our two ways real quick. Slywander. 20 years old at 72. Is he an RFA? No, he is not. Okay. You are coming here, buddy. Positions. Really hope New Void, Noiverth signs here, and Jamie Ben. Those are the big pieces of the puzzle to making the playoffs next season. Justin Williams, okay, perfect. Cozy Grossman. All right, so we're trending in the right direction. Rafi Torres, you already know the big captain for next year. Jamie Ben, that's what I'm talking about, and Noiverth. Wow, we are going to be a dangerous team next year holy just go ahead and sim the next season wow so the Montreal Canadiens are going to be a lethal team this year we got some firepower we got a goalie I, I'm not sure what our defense looks like though we're gonna have to check that out real quick we got young guys in the works. A couple years, man. Wow. We got Matthews already in the show. Line A should be a third line forward now. Wow. We might have to trade uh, Milan Gunch each soon. We have to see. I think we still have cap space, too. Holy freak. How long does it take to simulate the next season? There we are. Let's go check out these lines, boys. So, big Jamie Ben Stammers and Bo Bennett on the top line. Can't have three, though, so we're going to throw Justin Williams down. Sean. Okay, so. There. Matthews has an 89. Now, what's he going to say? a first line forward. That might be a bit of a problem with. Stammers. Hope Matthews doesn't mind playing second line minutes. Russell, big buff. That's what I'm talking about. We got pretty decent guys there. Bergman's at 78 now. He can play up in the show. I'm pretty sure these are just the uh, preseason lines. Fairly certain these will straighten up. After uh, after we go like this, sim through the start of this shit. Now, I think at the. Uh